politics. Dark, mysterious, and out of reach. 18 to 24 year olds are deemed to be half as likely to vote in general elections than the over 65 category. This can and should be different. When election results are decided by over 65s, manifestos are decided by over 65s. Let's change this. It's not good enough to only get interested in politics a week before an election. You need to start being aware of what's going on around you right now. The first time some of you will be able to cast your ballot will be in the EU referendum, which could be as soon as June. It's important to understand the political system you live in before you cast your vote. Here at the John Hamden Grammar School Question Time team, we all think young people have to get involved in politics. Here are some of them telling you why you should get involved in April. Right now, politics tends to forget our generation and will continue to do so until we engage with it. Just because you don't take an interest in politics doesn't mean that politics won't take an interest in you. Everyone should be involved because politics affects our daily lives and always will. All issues are political. Politics underpins the everyday workings of society. Sharing views and concerns is the most crucial factor in bettering society, not just for yourself, but for the communities we live in. This year, we have our best ever panel, featuring Journalist of the Year and Assistant Editor of The Spectator, Isabel Hardman, prominent Conservative Eurosceptic MEP, Dan Hammond, UKIP defector Roger Helmer MEP, Independent MP in the Labour Party, Giza Stewart, and Deputy Leader of the Liberal Democrats in the House of Lords, Lord McNally. Chairing the debate this year is Speaker of the House of Lords, Baroness D'Souza. Question time is being held at John Hamden Grammar School on Thursday the 14th of April. Tickets are free and you can book yours by following the link in the description. Can't make it? We are streaming the entire event live on this YouTube channel and you can add your voice to the debate on Twitter by using the hashtag JHGSQT. We hope to see you there.